motivates me is, is going towards a, a, a simpler and simpler description of a cell, but one in which I know what every gene is, is doing. That is going to be exciting. I think at the very least for some of those genes with unknown function or some essential functions that we do not know, um, we're going to learn some new chemistry. We are going to learn obviously some new biology. For once, we can really start understanding the rules of life. Once you can write down all the reactions, you can watch and account for all the energy molecules. Where are the energy molecules being made and what processes are using them and how are they using them? When I shift uh, the picture of the cell, how am I changing this balance of where it's produced and where it's being used? Those to me are all fascinating questions that should then get into the textbooks and down in, in teaching because you start talking about metabolism, for example, but people don't really understand what that means, all the uh, aspects of it. And I think this will help us with the synthetic biology to make it more precise, our language, and, and able to trace what is really happening.